let's look at the BNP uh, level, brain natriuretic peptide level, and its utility in the diagnosis and the management of heart failure. I would not recommend BNT, BNP levels to be done routinely in the workup of heart failure. It is very useful if a patient with dyspnea does not have a conclusive diagnosis as to whether it is the exacerbation of heart failure or a exacerbation of a respiratory condition. In this situation, an elevated BNP of more than 500 nanograms per liter will help confirm the diagnosis of possible heart failure. However, if the BNP level is less than 100 nanograms per liter, you can comfortably exclude heart failure as a cause of the person's dyspnea. BNP in the medium range that is between 100 nanograms per liter and 350 nanograms per liter may indicate possible right heart failure associated with lung disease, pulmonary embolism or even a renal failure. So BNP level has a diagnostic as well as a prognostic value in the setting of heart failure. However, it should not be routinely done. It is useful when you cannot distinguish the etiology of a patient's dyspnea. Also keep in mind that acute heart failure may sometimes present with a normal BNP level.